told your friend you're not okay And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way and Guess you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. You are watching For You Take. As I promised in the community post for the unofficial build of Evolution X. So after testing battery performance of Lineage OS 20 for the 3 days, today I flashed the Evolution X Unbound Android 13 build by Veritas. Flashing is same as all the old ROMs we flashed previously. You can check that from the iCard. If you are coming from the other ROM or even from the official build of Evolution X, then do the clean flash. So today in this video we will see what changes we get in the Android 13 build of Evolution X, its new customizations, performance, bugs and the issues along with the features that are missing. In this way you can conclude is this unofficial build is better than official or not. Now without further ado, let's get started. On the new adventure. So this unofficial build of Evolution X has the same old easter egg after completing the setup ROM booted to the Pixel Launcher. Now let's check out the about phone so we are upgraded to the new Android 13 build with the new easter egg of Android 13. Evolution X version is unbound 7.2 with its own easter egg like lineages ROMs. Security patch is of latest October 2022. Kernel version is 4.9.227 built it with the Android Clang Tool Gen 14 by the developer Veritas himself. Build date is of 7th October 2022. Sale Linux is enforcing. Now let's check out what you get in this build. Most surprising thing is that ROM comes with the fully working stock Oxonos camera. Actually first official build of Evolution X also didn't have this Oxonos camera. And because of its heavy request developer left the development of this ROM. In this camera all the features like the pro mode slow motion video recording are working very well but sometimes while using the slow motion camera may force close. Here is a sample of slow motion recording. Four K sixty FS recording is also working, nightscape mode, panorama mode, portrait modes for the front and the back camera all are working. ROM comes with the Oxonos Gallery application also. As this ROM is based on the Pixel Experience, all the goodies of Pixel Experience comes in this ROM. Like Pixel Launcher which has the new addition of at a glance with the Android 13 features. It has the new search your phone feature for the advanced search like the OnePlus Scout. There is a separate app available in the app drawer for the game space which has all the gaming features that you've seen in the last all Android 12 ROMs. ROM comes with the Evolution X wallpaper application which has awesome looking wallpapers. Let's see this build has the basic features working or not. So all the features are working like the Wi-Fi and Wi-Fi hotspot, NFC and GPS location, Bluetooth connection with the SBC, ACC and all HD supported codecs by your earphones. OnePlus Allah slider along with the fingerprint both are working flawlessly. So the major concern of the safety net is also solved here, it's getting passed without issues. ROM data storage is encrypted so there is no worry even if your device got stolen. ROM has the first time fully working new pixel battery widget which is showing the phone's battery along with the all the connected Bluetooth devices. ROM has the Google Photo unlimited photo backup feature. ROM comes with the app lock feature under the security tab so we can lock any of the application. ROM has the call recording feature and it's working. You will find call recording under the call log. Now it's time to see all the old customizations are available in this ROM or not. And answer is yes. Complete Evolver tab customizations are available in the ROM like theme, status bar, clock, notifications, etc. You can check all these detailed customizations with the video available in the iCard. Now I will only tell you the newly added features. ROM comes with the nothing was headline and body fonts under the themes and the font section. And this one is amazing feature actually it's giving the something similar look of nothing was to device. Another new addition for the power menu animation under the animation tab is available but it seems not working. These are only two different additions I found under the customizations. 
Now let's test the performance of the new and official build using the Geekbench. Once again after a long time, I got higher score than any other ROM I tested after nameless Android 12 based ROM. For single core I got 518 while for the multi core I got double to 37. Both those scores are way higher than default results. While on the OpenGL we got double to 43 and for Vulkan graphics we got 1884. Both those scores are good but in the real life you just sometimes have failed sudden jitter and lag while using the ROM which solves automatically. Now let's discuss the issues, bugs or the missing features of the ROM. First one ROM did not pass the void one L1 test, it's on the L3 like all the old ROMs so we cannot watch the Netflix or Amazon Prime on the full HD resolution. ROM has the media cover art feature in the customization setting but it's not working. ROM has the same old bug of Hey Google along with the lag in the audio and video playback. This issue may be device specific issue for only some devices. Next is the ROM did not comes with the OT updater. So you need to manually download the update zip and need to flash it via TWRP. All these issues or the bugs are not so deal breaking. So in my opinion, this new unofficial build is really good replacement choice for the old official build of Evolution X, which was banned by the Anirim Bliss. Developer very toss seems positive for regular updates of this ROM. So my recommendation is definitely go with this if you are a fan of Evolution X. Battery life not tested yet, I will report it with the community post after 2 days of battery cycle. That is all about the new and the latest and official Evolution X. Hope you guys like my work then please do like and share this video, subscribe to the channel, press the bell icon for the notification of our upcoming content. Thanks for watching, see you next time, take care, bye bye.